I literally could not agree with this more. I remember there was a guy where I used to work. He was 21 years old. He had over $20,000 in Snap-on boxes, right? He, he would always make fun of my, my stuff, right? Because U.S. General, um, I got Milwaukee's, right? Or I got my Harbor Freight. I got an AC Delco ratchet. And one day, I remember we were discussing, like, I was like, dude, how much did you spend on your brass hammer? Because I really liked it. He was like, it's Mako. I have no idea. I mean, I looked it up. I remember it was over $200. And I was just shocked. It was huge. Bigger than that. And then it's like other thing. He had like the Matco, same exact thing as this. This is the Astro one. And then he was like, yeah, it's like 150 bucks. That's 70 bucks. Or the airlift, right? You get the snap on one. That's three or four times the cost. It's like you want return on investment, right? The more you spend on your tool, the more money you're going to have to make to make up for it. When you buy a cheaper tool, less you have to make to make up for that tool. And that's just my thing, so.